Hello and welcome to another video. My name is Boxiest, and today we are going to continue the What If series. What if events had gone differently? And in this What If, we're going to change the history of Cobra Kai. What if Miguel fought Kenny during the events of Cobra Kai Season 5? So in this timeline, the events of Cobra Kai Season 5 would still happen. Daniel and Johnny would still find out about the Saikai Taikai, and they would still want to enter. So they would still want to convince the judges to let them compete, and those events would stay the same. Each dojo would still have to choose a male and female fighter. Cobra Kai would still choose Kenny and Tori. Daniel would pick Sam to represent them, and Johnny would have a hard time choosing between Miguel, Robbie, and Hawk. Robbie would say that it should either be Miguel or Hawk, since they both beat him fair and square. And Hawk would say that it should be Miguel because he's technically an undefeated All-Valley champion. Miguel would want a chance to redeem himself for ditching the All-Valley tournament and letting Johnny down, so Johnny would choose Miguel to represent them and they would start training. The events of Season 5 would carry on, and the night of the match, Robbie would be surprised that Cobra Kai chose Kenny, so he would tell Miguel to take it easy on Kenny, so Miguel would listen to Robbie and the match would begin. Miguel would be fighting defensively and he would only be using the Aido. Kenny would use his speed and he would get the first point on Miguel. The score would be 1-0. Johnny would tell Miguel to remember the pitching machine and to not get hit, so the match would continue. Miguel would remember to circle his opponent and he wouldn't let Kenny hit him. Miguel would land a hit on Kenny, but the referee wouldn't count it. The score would still be 1-0. Miguel would realize that the referee wasn't on his side, so he would call for a timeout and he would want to talk to the senseis and Robbie. Miguel would say that if he continued to hold back, he wasn't going to get a point against Kenny with the referee against him. Robbie would realize that if Kenny won, it was going to send him down a darker path. So Robbie would tell Miguel to stop holding back, but to make sure to not hurt Kenny. Miguel would agree, and the match would continue. This time Miguel would be using a combination of Eagle Fang and Miyaido, and he would be the one to strike first, and he would get a point on Kenny. The score would be 1-1. Miguel would continue fighting Kenny, and he would get a second point. Kenny would have no choice, and he would want to use a silver bullet technique on Miguel, and Kenny would be ready to strike but Miguel would use a drum technique, and he would push away the silver bullet. And at the last minute, Miguel would do a back kick on Kenny, and he would beat Kenny in this timeline. Miyai Feng would celebrate, and since Tori never realized that Terry Silver paid off the referee again, she would fight Sam in this timeline. Sam would use a combination of Eagle Fang and Miyai Do, and she would land a hit on Tori, but the referee wouldn't count it. This is when Tori would realize that the referee was on her side again, and she wouldn't want to beat Sam by cheating again. The match would continue, and Tori would let Sam score more points on her, so Sam would beat Tori in this timeline. Only Miyai Fang would qualify for the Saikai Taikai in this timeline, and Tiri Silver would be mad. The Miyai Fangs would go celebrate, and those events would stay the same. Tiri Silver would want to get revenge on Miyai Fang, and he would send some of his senseis to burn down the Miyai Do Dojo. And the next day, Daniel would see Mr. Miyai's house burn to the ground, and he would be angry. So he would want to go confront Terry Silver right then and there. So Daniel, Johnny, and Chosen would go confront Terry Silver at his house. So Daniel, Johnny, and Chosen would fight off Cobra Kai Senseis. Daniel and Terry would have a rematch. Daniel would want to get his revenge. Johnny and Chosen would defeat the Cobra Kai Senseis, and they would help Daniel take down Terry Silver. The police would arrive, and they would arrest Daniel, Johnny, and Chosen. Terry Silver would press charges, and in this timeline, Terry Silver wouldn't be exposed, so Cobra Kai wouldn't shut down and would continue to operate. And that is where I'm going to end this what if. Thank you guys for watching. What do you guys think would have happened if Miguel fought Kenny during the events of Cobra Kai Season 5? Let me know in the comments below. YouTube lets me know that the majority of you are not subscribed, so if you guys could subscribe, that would be much appreciated. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like this video, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. And I'll see you guys next time.